A spiritual awakening is a deeply personal and profound journey that unfolds at the precise moment determined by your higher self. Imagine this awakening as a spiritual calling, a beckoning to enter into a metaphorical battlefield. But what you may wonder, does this metaphorical battlefield represent? Our world today is far from an ideal state, characterized by corruption, deception, manipulation, violence, fear, and stress, all deliberately orchestrated to keep your spirit subdued, your hearts wounded, and your faith in a better world dimmed. Yet in the midst of this turmoil and chaos, a profound and enduring truth emerges. Even when surrounded by darkness, the flame of love within you continues to burn brightly. It is an inner light that no external force can completely extinguish. Sadly, the world often presents you with acts of unnecessary violence and suffering. Nevertheless, your enduring capacity to nurture and emanate love serves as a beacon of hope, guiding you towards a more spiritually aligned and harmonious existence. So what are the five stages of a spiritual awakening? The veils of illusion gently begin to part, and as they do, you may find yourself exclaiming with newfound clarity, this is indeed the realm of challenges and revelations. In the initial stage of a spiritual awakening, a profound shift occurs in your perception of the world, and it can be initially startling and eye-opening. It's as if a hidden truth concealed beneath layers of societal conditioning and personal limitations begins to emerge, unveiling the intricate tapestry of the world in an entirely new light. As you navigate this transformation, you may feel like you're straddling two worlds, the old and the new. The old world, often referred to as the current world, is unveiled in its stark reality, with its share of corruption, disharmony and discord. It can be disheartening to witness the extent of these issues and the deeply ingrained patterns that perpetuate them. However, amid this unveiling, you may experience a profound attraction to the new world, a realm characterized by purity, interconnectedness and a higher sense of purpose. It beckons with the promise of novelty, magic and the awakening of your authentic self. Spoiler alert, the current world or the old world is corrupted beyond repair, which is why we are being awakened to gradually move into the new earth. In the second stage of your spiritual awakening, you embark on a remarkable quest for knowledge. You delve into a diverse array of subjects, each unveiling layers of wisdom and insight. Now I'm here to provide you with a list of subjects and topics that align with your interests. Please share with me which ones resonate with you most. Astrology, the celestial movements and energies that shape our lives and personalities. Philosophy, the profound exploration of fundamental questions about existence, knowledge, ethics, and reality. Psychology, the study of the human mind and behavior, offering insights into our inner workings. Biology, a deeper understanding of life and its intricacies, from cellular processes to ecosystems, ancient runes, a connection to ancient languages and symbols, delving into their hidden meanings and significance. Quantum physics, the exploration of the fundamental building blocks of the universe and their mysterious behavior. History, the revelations of past events, societies and cultures shedding light on our shared human story. This phase involves filling in the gaps that the conventional education system might have intentionally omitted and unraveling the layers of false information that society and media have perpetuated over the years. At this juncture, you embark on a holistic journey of self-discovery and self-improvement. It encompasses relearning how to be human from the very basics like how you breathe and how you exercise to more profound choices such as who you choose to surround yourself with and what you nourish your body with daily. Eventually, this path leads you to a pivotal stage known as inner child healing and shadow work. Here you confront and heal the wounds and unprocessed emotions from your past, addressing the aspects of yourself that have remained hidden in the shadows. This inner work is a profound and transformative process, guiding you towards greater self-awareness and spiritual growth on your awakening journey. The dark night of the soul is a profound journey that revolves around confronting your deepest pain and fears. It's a time for embracing the transformative processes of inner child healing and shadow work. In the third stage of your spiritual awakening, you face your most formidable adversary, 
your own self. This phase necessitates a courageous exploration of every memory that has inflicted pain, sorrow, disappointment, heartache and emotional wounds upon you. It is a momentous undertaking, one that ultimately requires an act of forgiveness, both towards others and perhaps most importantly, towards yourself. The first part of this stage is dedicated to inner child healing. This entails revisiting the wounds and traumas of your past, nurturing and healing the wounded inner child within you. It's a process of acknowledging the pain, providing it with the love and care it was denied, and ultimately letting go of the burdens that have weighed you down for so long. Once the inner child healing process is underway, you move into the second phase of this stage, shadow work. Shadow work is a profound introspective journey where you delve into the aspects of yourself that may have caused pain in the lives of others. It involves a critical examination of your belief systems, behaviors, and actions with the aim of uncovering those parts of your psyche that have been in the shadows, influencing your choices and interactions. The purpose of shadow work is to bring these hidden elements to light so you can consciously work towards transformation and aligning your thoughts, behaviors, and choices with a higher consciousness. This not only prevents further harm to yourself, but also ensures that you no longer inadvertently hurt others in the process. In the profound journey of spiritual awakening, the mantra becomes clear. Anything out of alignment must make way for the new. It's a process of shedding the old to make room for the new, aligning with your authentic self. The fourth stage of awakening can be perceived as even more tumultuous than the dark night of the soul. However, there's a silver lining to this chaos. The ego death that often accompanies this stage is typically of shorter duration than the previous phase. After diligently doing the inner work, your external surroundings need to catch up with the profound identity shift you've undergone. This is when you begin to experience the shedding of old jobs, friendships, hobbies and connections to anything and everything that no longer resonates with your true self. It's natural to feel somewhat lost during this phase, but it's important to recognize that this process is preparing you for what lies ahead. It's paving the way for a remarkable reunion with your true soul tribe. Individuals who are aligned with your higher calling and your soul's purpose, these are the people who will co-create with you on a deeper level as you collectively step into your authentic selves and embrace your higher purpose in life. In essence, this stage marks a powerful transition where you release the attachments to the past and make space for the alignment of your present and future with your true essence, setting the stage for meaningful co-creation and spiritual fulfillment. This phase is often referred to as the return to self, the ultimate reunion with your higher self, it marks the moment of complete alignment with authenticity and the realization of your soul's purpose. After years of conditioning within the confines of the 3D world, returning to the natural world might initially feel unfamiliar. As you begin to re-establish a deep connection with nature, you may marvel at how you were once disconnected from its profound beauty. It becomes evident that this disconnection was engineered serving as a means to tether you to an artificial system of existence. Now, as we rise to claim our freedom and rekindle our connection to the natural world and our higher selves, the real work of effecting positive change in the world begins. It is a powerful phase of transformation, where we not only rediscover our authentic selves, but also embark on a mission to bring about meaningful and positive shifts in our existence and the world at large. If you resonate with any or all of these aspects, it's quite likely that you are going through a spiritual awakening. I want to express my sincere appreciation for the energy and effort you contribute simply by being here. To all those who are on this remarkable journey, I extend my heartfelt gratitude. It's an honor to walk alongside you during this time of transformation and rebirth. Keep shining your light and may blessings be showered upon all the beautiful souls from the Abundance Master.